welcome to the fun accountant today i'm going to show you how to import transactions from net cash who was previously known as sage pay into your sage accounting now net cash is a payment mechanism and it works basically like a bank account so for many of us working on sage we would have found that there is a direct link or a bank feed under Sage for Sage Pay or Net Cash. But you will find that this bank feed doesn't work that well. So, what do you do then? Get your transactions into Sage. What we do is we punch it all in. No, that is not what we what we do with automation or with cloud accounting we want to import many transactions as possible so what you do you hop over to your netcash I'm, i've already signed up into my demo netcash account i will go to services account i will select reports and i will click on statement download from the statement download, I will select the desired dates. I would like to import from 1st of November till now. And the net cash already populated transactions for you. And all I have to do is I press CSV. Right. After I've done CSV, you will notice that the statement has been downloaded. Right. It's been downloaded. I'm going back to Sage. I'm going into my banking transaction screen. I'm looking for my net cash bank account and I see there are no net cash bank account here so I'm going to add a new one call it net cash category there is no category so I'm going to say default is EFTs bank name net cash account it is an active account it's, I'm not going to make it my default account because I would rather have my normal bank account as a default the normal bank account is when most of my transactions happens. But if Netcash is the bank account that you use for most of your transactions, by all means, press on the default button. I'm going to press save. And my Netcash bank account has been created. I hope over to import bank statements. The first thing I have to look at is import file type. I'm going to say sage pay csv right we know it's not sage pay anymore but net cash but this import still works date format i leave it as it is i browse for my file just press import file Egg. and there we go i receive a message telling me how many rows has been imported and how many rows needs to be allocated Press that, and here is all my sites by transactions for that period that I've selected to import. Brilliant! That is how you import your bank transactions from Netcash. What I do over here now, I can I can now start allocating my accounts to, to which category I want to allocate it to. This is received. So probably it will be a customer, select customer, select the customer it should go to, happy go lucky is in that case the customer and voila, that transaction is now allocated from my bank account to my customer account. So this is how we basically import transactions from Netcash, the old sites pay into my sage accounting from here you don't have to enter anything your transactions is there your date is there your description as it appeared on the bank statements is there the reference is already been done for you the amount has been already recorded it is how it appeared on your bank and you just have to allocate thank you very much for watching this video about how to import transactions from Netcash to your site banking.